Yeah, I've just been to uh, see the production and uh, just like to say how uh, good I thought it was. The uh, performances were absolutely superb. The, the lighting was brilliant, the script was really tight, the actors were acting in a really great style, a kind of film noir thing which really worked. Um, there was brilliant pacing to it, which is really rare in theatre at the moment, and the kind of the moments of pause and thought were really, really good. I really enjoyed it. Hi, we're just going to have a quick chat with uh, Alexander Moskos, who is an actor who played Max today in uh, the first draft performance of Darker. Alex, hello. <laughs> hello. Um, how did you find working with first draft? Um, I absolutely loved it. I think, as an actor, it's very important that you're kept on your feet all the time, kept on your toes. Um, and that's what happens here naturally, because you do have three days of rehearsals, and then smack, you're there performing for three nights. And because of it being advertised as a scratch um, company, you sort of go in thinking that you'll be on book and you'll do all of this thing, these things, but you soon realize that everyone's really on it. You have a very good director on board, even have an assistant director on board, which you usually don't have um, on small productions. Um, and I just like that people get the opportunity to put really good ideas out there and that we, with the writers, can explore it and we can explore it together. So I think that's really the main thing about working with First Draft. Okay. And how did you find tonight's performance and the, the audience, the venue? How was it for you tonight as a performance space? The venue is absolutely fantastic because it has, it has a very domestic feel to it. So you never feel, um, you never feel nervous because you know that these people in the armchairs around you, they seem to be on your side. Um, and tonight's performance was very interesting because it has changed a lot from the first time we did it. Um, so the second draft got a very different um, reaction from the audience, which is always interesting with a piece like this because at, we're still exploring it and you can tell that the audience is exploring it with us and we're not just dishing something out to them. They really, really have to think and they're thinking with us, which, and I thought it went pretty well. Ooh. Yeah. Okay, and uh, so you would recommend First Draft to uh, everyone else to write us? I mean, how do you find the promotion? Do you think that, that we're giving it everything that, that you would need to, uh, as, you know, at least the, what, what do you think of the submissions, the writing, um, and the website? Well, I think all of that works very well considering um, the quality of writing you will you received I think um, a lot of people who are writing something might think that their their writing isn't good enough or they don't have enough of it and that's the great thing about first draft and I don't think a lot of people are aware of that that you only need an idea you only need you know maybe just an, a sentence of something that you really believe in and with the actors and the director um, and the producer, you make it happen. Yeah. So I think a lot, a lot more people can actually submit things. And you're a bit of a writer yourself, aren't you? Yeah, I mean, that's the really, that's the most interesting thing, is that I never considered myself as a writer. And then I had this short story just lying about. And um, you and uh, the artistic director found out about it and just made it into a really nice one-woman monologue, which I thought, uh, I felt really proud, and I felt like I had achieved something with the help of you guys. Um, so I think that's what I was trying to say, that you know, you don't need to be a writer. You don't need to consider yourself a writer. No, you just need an idea, and yeah. that's, that's, the, that's why we started First Draft, was so anyone out there whatever age if they've got an idea please send it to us um, and, and we'll have a look and, and you know you never, you never know you're writing maybe on for a full run at the horse or you know we're developing it further so please send us your submissions and take a look at our website 
which is www.firstdraft.org.uk. Thank you very much, Alex. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs>